This is Marco Wu from eProgrammer.com. I'm going to talk about how can we measure dimension in AutoCAD. If you just start using um, AutoCAD, you may just like, need to click on this dimension icon and then click to the corner, go to the corner, click on it, click on this. And then you can see basically it tells you it is around 1.85 inch. Why do I say it is around? Because I, um, it only shows two dec decimal points in here. But assume we accept this at this point. So, well, how about I want to measure the vertical uh, dimension? Do this. Um, 0 0.79. Well, can I type a command to do measure dimension? Yes, DIM. Well, you can see like it asks for an other input. So we need to type horizontal. Then we can measure dimension here. And it asks you to enter the dimension text in here. It measure is 3.46 inch. But if we want to show something else, if we want to say it is 5, instead of 3.46 because of some special reason we can do that um, but we want to keep it at 3.46 in here we just press enter now just now is d-i-m-h-o-r now i type v-e-r that is vertical the command for vertical and then it also asks for enter the uh, dimension text i just like press enter okay so Assume this time I want to do a bit difference. Enter the dimension text once again I can at five. Then it will tell you the distance in there is five. Okay. Now another dimension type. Continuous and baseline. This two is a bit funny. Continuous. You see, when I kick it, it has already started something from there. It continues to the next point. You can see, okay, maybe you don't follow it. Now, once again, I do a, well, I first I do a dimension. I measure dimension here, okay, 1.85. Now I press continuous, continuous. Now you can see how continuous work in here, right? And put escape. Okay, assume I want to pick this point, this corner point to be origin. To be origin, so how can we do that? I do a dimension in here. This time I do a baseline. You can see it based on this corner. Okay, so it's based on this corner and tell me the distance. Well, sometimes it's just not good to show the dimension like this because uh, it's just not convenient to read. There is another type of dimension, style. Now, assume I want to pick this corner as the um, or region. What can we do? Type UCS in here. Pick this corner. Accept it. That would be your new origin. Pick ordinate. Click on this corner. Move it down a little bit. Left click. Now, I'm going to do a baseline. You see the di well, you see the style is different. It is much easier to read. This is two different type of baseline style and based on different people but I prefer this one it's clear it is you don't have to show so many long line across like the whole joint and this is not just like continuous tells you oh how many to get from one point to another point and well but it is totally depend on what are you working on um, so this is the dimension tutorial in AutoCAD.